Miss Food City 2024 Addison Smith was crowned on October 28th and she joins us on this Food City Friday to share with us how her reign as Miss Food City has gone so far. And we're also going to tell you about how Food City is honoring veterans tomorrow on Veterans Day. Good morning, Addison. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fantastic. Yeah. Brand new Miss Food City. Let's talk about October the 28th, <laughs> a magical night for you. Kind of talk us through that. How, how was the pageant? How was that evening for you? Yeah, it was the most amazing experience just overall. I did it last year and it was so much fun. I knew I was going to go back and do it again. And then to win the crown was just the best outcome possible. And I'm just so absolutely thrilled and I can't wait for what's to come. Now my co-host Amy, you know, she was the one of the judges this yeah. year, and I've judged the, I've judged the pageant. There's Amy with you the night of, <laughs> and she said you did fantastic. I mean, you just did a fantastic <laughs> job. And talk to me that night has got to be extra special. I mean, it, yeah. when, when they put that crown on you, it's <laughs> got to make you feel proud. Oh yeah, for sure. I was so nervous going into it. I was actually the last one called for top five, so I was like, oh man, maybe it's not meant to be. But then when they called my name, I just can't even describe the just overwhelming happiness. It felt like it was such a surreal moment. Right. So I was just so filled with joy. Right. Tell our viewers about something about you. Tell us about your history, what you got going on right now. You know, tell us about Addison. Yeah, so I'm currently a junior at the University of Tennessee majoring in supply chain management. I also have a photography business. I love doing photography, so I actually have some Christmas minis coming up. All right. And yeah, I'm just super excited to represent Food City and for all that's to come is this role. Now, since you were crowned until now, what have you been doing? Is oh my gosh, it's been the coolest experience. I've been crowned for about two weeks and yeah. I got to attend the Kelsey Ballerini concert at the Food City Center. And so that was just so cool. And then I also got to attend a UT football game, which even though I'm a student, it was my first game of the season. Right. And I got to watch it from the suites, which was just the best way possible. So I don't know if I can go back. <laughs> <laughs> the you don't know if you now. go back no, out I'm the seat. I'm spoiled. Seats. It was yeah. so fun, and I have some really fun stuff coming up. So. Right. It's going to be cool. And, you know, Thompson Bowling being renamed the Food City yeah. Center, that is, and you're Miss Food City, that is going to be, that's, that could have happened better for you. I know timing what I'm saying. I think it's just the perfect timing. I feel like this year was truly meant for me, and I'm just so excited. What are you looking forward to going, looking ahead to the upcoming year? Yeah, I'm so excited for just the growth that I'm going to experience and all the different people that I'll get to meet and all the lives I'll get to touch. I just know that it's going to be the most amazing year in my life, and I'm just hope that it can impact so many people through this. So many events that you're going to be part yeah. of. I mean, just <laughs> just thinking right off the top of my head, you know, you're going to have more ball games. You're going to have races at BMS, mm -hmm. things of that nature, store openings. It is going to be a busy year. Yeah. What are you hoping to accomplish during your time as Miss Food City? Yeah, I hope that I can just make an impact on as many people as possible. I said in my onstage question that I want to be a light, and I truly do. I just want to shed light to so many people and just represent Food City in the best way possible. And what are your future plans for you personally? Looking beyond the Miss Food City <laughs> year, what are your future plans? Yeah, so I'll graduate next December from UT, so I hope to get a good career. I actually said on my page that I want to intern with Food City, okay. so I think we'll you got I think you we'll got it in. I think you got it in there. <laughs> yeah, and then just get married and start a family. I got you. All right. Addison, thank you so much for stopping by today. Thank you for having me. <laughs> All right. The food's a very special Food City Friday, and we want to remind you, coming up tomorrow on Veterans Day, Food City, veterans and active military will eat free at your local Food City, and we have the information for you right there on the screen.